Association with Marked on Marker Board Productions presents With the karaoke machine that I got from an estate sale today came lots of things. The microphone I tested and found that the original mic is bad. With this thing the head was off whenever I got it. The contact must have broken inside because it will not work. Yet it is metal cased and it does use an XLR jack a symbol of true quality made into this 1983 karaoke machine. Many 8-track tapes do I have that go along with it as well stupid camera as songbook for the singing machine. which contains lyrics to the songs on the different tapes 8-track tapes to be exact as well as the owner's manual with a set of q-tips inside for head cleaning purposes a little thing here probably to send it to repair or something like that, Some, probably a business card and the manual there's a machine shown. This singing machine. This is different ways of the manual. It also has a cassette thing on it. Plan to be making the video outside of the actual thing. Along with the specifications for like the instant the the eight track player for example and so. And then go to the cassette section you see it's AC bias. In my experience with modern day karaoke machines they seem to be DC bias and cheaply produced. Well this one is a quality made machine and I hope you'll be enjoying the the video of it. Not only is there this box of 8 track tapes which is quite a number of original singing machine cartridges there's another box plenty full of 8 tracks that that come with the singing machine. Original cartridges to it. I mean check that out. And then there's even more down in there. That each are stacked to like that. It's a lot of eight tracks. You ask me, it's a lot of eight tracks. I haven't tested them yet, but a pair of RCA speakers I also got today. Here you can see the karaoke machine. Before I start demonstrating its operation, I just want to show you some close-up details of it. It's made by a company called The Singing Machine. Play eight tracks, play and record cassettes. It's pitch control, echo, eight inch, full range, speaker. Let's get to business now. It's starting to rain, which is insane. That rhymes. It's starting to rain, it's insane. Oh, oh yeah, I have the echo function turned off right now, so here it is. Give the mic out louder. Here gives a shout out to you two guys, Spatsbear1, the musician, uh, Supermatch2007, KS772, Clyde Sight, 2B07, uh, Retro Chad, J Blair1982. All American Five Radio. It's different people. If, if uh, anybody I didn't mention, um, it's just because I couldn't come to mind at this moment in time. Yet, it's a very neat echo, reverb echo function of this machine is really cool. You can adjust it. This is how much echo it has to maximum echo right there. The cassette master presentation. Now let's um, try cassette record. We'll first let's see. Okay. Now I am recording on the cassette deck. It's a high quality AC bias. Put in the echo and it will record the echo. Let's see. I have to go back like that. Pause. Unpause. Rewind. And. I was ready to pay a visit. She used to look like T-Tor. 
Now I am recording on the cassette deck. It's a high quality AC bias. Find the echo and it will record the echo. And see, it'll go back like that. Pause, unpause. Very high quality unit. I really like it a lot. See, I one of the song tapes play. Right here. When I was playing these, I didn't find any of them that have a bad splice. You plug it in, and then you press the start button. I'm not kidding. Last time I played this, it was playing just fine. Now for the video crosstalks. That's just insane. Tapes. He had many 8-track tapes It was quite something to have 8-track tapes He started recording on a cassette recorder Wondering what happened next It was quite an interesting thing to have this Yeah 8-track 8-track Echoing Eight traps, echoing eight traps. When the eight track echoed, it was quite something. Eight stereo eight, eight track tape, eight stereo eight, eight track tape, eight stereo, eight stereo, eight stereo eight. Eight. select programs. The songs aren't all the same length, so if you want to get to the end of the 8-track, you press the Q button, and then that will make it tape to the rest of the tape, and then automatically stop when it senses a sensing foil splice. Oh yes, yeah, so I also needed to demonstrate pitch control of the 8-track. So take out this 8-track. Wait until that one gets to the end. Okay, it's at the end. Let's get another eight track. <clears throat> Start. Wait, stop the cassette on. Stop the cassette. Pitch control. Get away with speedo. Jack him, 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 something to show this is made by a world star it's very it's so that the, I think it's just the same thing as the musicians crack co eight track to I mean cassette to eight track adapter yet this is made by a world star it takes the motor it takes a capstan drive to a rubber roller and that's how it turns the tape it uses a 1.5 volt AA battery to run the amp to drive it and I'll present its operation on the eight track Start. 
So. There it goes. It's working. Let's try to count one closer.